welcome to all. Thank you, Christoph. Thank you for having chosen our city. Uh, we are very proud of the fact that you're all here, and I'm very proud of what I've seen in this uh, hour that I spent with you in seeing all this testing. Um, I'll just want to share three remarks. Uh, um, the first is that, as I hope you have had the opportunity to see, Torino is a city that decided, not only obviously the mayor, but the whole ecosystem, which means companies, and universities, and the local administration, has decided to point on innovation and to try to face the challenges without fear. There are always, there's, I mean, about innovation. If, for example, it will bring jobs, it will take away jobs. There, there's a lot of discussion and it's normal. It will change completely our lives, our way of working, our companies. What's happening here in the city? is that we decided to face that challenge without fear and trying to maximize the opportunities and minimize the risks. And I think this is the way and the right approach that local administrations should have when we talk about innovation, what innovation can bring. The second remark is that to do this, what we need is partnerships. And uh, the policy that we uh, built, that we are building in the city that is called Torino City Lab, is based on exactly the partnership between public and private. I mean, a public institution alone is not able to do what, what I was talking about. And also, a private company alone is not able to do that. The public needs the private that has the technology, and the private needs the public that has the city, that has the urban community. I mean, we all know that by 2050, 70% of the people will live in urban contests. So imagine how this mix of the cities that face the challenges that we were talking about, security, uh, let's also talk about waste, let's talk about I mean, environment challenges, the communities, local communities are facing the challenges, but they need the partnership with the private companies that have the technology. And so this is why we are very proud to work and partnership with 5GAA, because we need you, and I'm quite sure that in some way you need us in this uh, horizontal uh, partnership. And uh, the third uh, remark is that these technologies that we're trying to test, because Torino City Lab is a policy that says you private company, you want to come in our city and <coughs> test the technology? We, we were the first city in Italy testing 5G, for example. We are testing autonomous guidance, as you saw. But you private company, you want to come in our city and test the technology? Okay. We as a city want to be a laboratory where you can experiment, test in an open environment. And so that's what we're doing. And the third remark is that this means testing together, public and private, means facing that challenge that I was talking about. And um, I'm sure from what I've seen today that technology will change dramatically our way of living in the cities, how we'll move around the city, how cities will talk, how cars will talk, and the responsibility that we have as policymakers or as uh, I mean, local mayors is to understand what will happen in the next 15 years and create the contest today to maximize what will happen in the next 15 years. And that's what we're doing, thanks, obviously, to partnerships as, as the one of today. So that's why we're so proud that uh, you are here today. That's why we're proud that companies and, uh, are creating this cooperative environment. It's what we need, more than a competitive environment to face the challenge. And so thank you very much for being here, and thank you very much for what we'll do in, the, in these days. And I hope, I say it as a mayor, that you also have a bit of time to taste our food, our wine, and see a bit of museums, because Serena is also a wonderful city from the cultural point of view. So enjoy your stay and thank you for being here and thank you for having chosen our city.